excited to take you through our spring morning routine and today is actually Saturday so we're able to kind of take things a bit slower and just kind of soak up and savor the morning a bit more than we typically are able to during the week and today Saturday is the day we go to the farmers market so we're gonna do that later and we're really just gonna soak up the day but truly one of my favorite things in life are spring Saturday mornings so I'm I'm excited to enjoy today and spend some time with you all. first thing I do is head downstairs to say good morning to our sweet little puppy. I also love to get some ice cold water because I'm always super thirsty in the morning and the ice really just helps me wake up and feel refreshed. <laughs> Palmer pretty much has to go to the potty immediately, so I take him outside, we go on a little walk. This morning I just did a short walk since we were taking him to the farmer's market later in the day, so I didn't want to tire him out too much, but it always feels nice to step outside and soak up the sunshine even for just a couple minutes. Once we're back inside, I like to turn on some peaceful music. I typically opt to play some peaceful worship music. I'll link one of my playlists down below. It really just soothes my soul and it helps me start my day on the right foot. Now it's time for coffee. So I get my water boiling on the stove top and then prep my French press, add in my coffee grounds and just wait for the water to boil. And my husband took Palmer back outside for a little play session. They love to spend time together in the morning and do some training. While they were doing that, I did my jade roller. This also just wakes me up, helps me feel refreshed. I love to keep it in the fridge because it just is so cooling and kind of helps with my morning puffiness. Now I cozy up on the couch and it gets started on my quiet time. During this time, I just like to read my devotional, my Bible, and some kind of book. And it really is kind of different every morning, but the core stays the same. Basically, I'm just taking a moment to pray and just prep my mind and heart for the rest of the day. I'll link some of my favorite devotional books in the description. Once I finish with my quiet time, it's time to start cooking some breakfast. And today, since it's Saturday, we like to do something a bit more exciting for breakfast. And I recently picked up this super cute flour waffle maker. So this morning I'm gonna have some fresh fruit and some waffles. Mm -hmm. 
we love to do a combination of dark chocolate waffles and just regular waffles. And for the dark chocolate waffles, I just use the Kodiak cake dark chocolate mixture. It's so easy. You just add some water to the mix and it's as simple as that. And then for our just kind of plain classic waffles, I followed a recipe, but it wasn't my favorite. They were okay. We still ate them all, but it wasn't my favorite. So if you guys have any really yummy waffle recipes, please let me know because I'm still on the hunt for a good one. with breakfast Brandon cleaned up the kitchen and just tidied up a bit while I head upstairs to get ready for the day I also made our bed when I went upstairs and I just kind of did some light makeup and I didn't end up touching up my hair at all on this day because I knew I was gonna wear a hat to the farmer's market, so I just kinda let it be. One thing that's been really important, especially in the spring and summer for me though, is my sunscreen. So I have a few different favorite sunscreens that I kind of switch off with, but today I did my Super Goop Glow Screen and I really like this one because it has a little bit of a tint to it, so it helps kind of even your skin tone a bit. And I also love to use my Tula Glow and Get It Eye Balm because this just is so refreshing and adds a nice little tingle and shimmer under my eyes. Today I decided to wear this cute two-piece floral set. It was actually my first time wearing it. Very exciting. So I still had the tags on, but I snipped those off before we hit the road. Today was extra exciting because it was Palmer's first time at the farmer's market. So needless to say, he was overjoyed and living his very best life. He got to make some new dog friends and people friends and just had the time of his life. I lose my breath whenever I see you. You stole my heart, what is it that you do? the 
goodies I picked up. Of course, I picked up fresh flowers and then some sunflower microgreens, sweet potatoes, cucumber, romaine lettuce, radishes, just kind of a hodgepodge of goodies. You set my word on fire I don't know what I'd do without you You make me smile, what is it that you do? My life was great till you added color All right, friends, that is going to be it for my spring morning routine. I really hope you all enjoyed it and enjoyed spending time with us today. Plummer is just at my feet. He is definitely due for a little nap time after that big morning adventure. But thank you guys so much for watching and spending time with me today. I really hope you guys have a beautiful spring season and I cannot wait to see you super soon. Bye!